Ellie DeGeneres addresses workplace scandal. American comedian, a television host, Ellen DeGeneres, has responded to the mean girl allegations that surrounded our talk show, uh, ultimately uh, leading to its end. During a recent stand-up performance in Santa Rosa, California, the comedian addressed the controversy uh, directly, saying, I am many things, but I am not mean. While defending herself, she acknowledged, I can be demanding impatient and tough I am a strong woman if you would recall Ellen DeGeneres stepped away from her famous talk show in 2022 following accusations from former staffers about a toxic workplace environment she told the audience that the scandal had forced her to confront and break down some of her personal barriers in our recent stand-up appearances Ellen has been more open about the impact of the controversy during a gig last month she discussed the the toll and the negative publicity took on our self-esteem, admitting that she avoided news coverage, portraying her in a negative light. And I can really understand this. You know, the way we were talking about Ellen DeGeneres, she is actually very generous. So people go on her show and then she gives them a lot of things. Sometimes, you know, I've even watched a particular episode where um, a black man from Africa you know, could not even afford his parents to come to the United States. And she sponsored it. She, she, she even surprised the person, like the person did not know that the parents would, you know, make it there. And she's done a lot, a lot. And then when you now hear about this, like, you know, in the social space, you hear that, you see that this person is generous. And then you see people who are very close to them saying stuff about them, like they don't treat their staff well and all of this. So she had to step away from that, uh, from the show. And now she's coming publicly to say that you know what I am not mean I can be tough I can be many things but I am not mean but do you think that in this life yeah. even if you're very very nice yeah there will be still be one person who just feels like you're not nice because you see, J. Paul, I can meet you now. You can okay, you can run into me this morning, and then maybe I've had a very bad morning, and mm. then I'm all cranky, mm. and you know I don't I don't greet you well, and that's mm. the first time you're running into me, and you're like, ah, well. She's just, I mean, she, she's not even fun mm. to be with and all that. And then sometimes maybe I'm just happy and another person runs into me and they're like, oh my God, she's so nice. Ah! And then I'm like, okay. Um, so it's, 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 it's nice that you mentioned that at least one person should be able to stand up and say that uh, he's a good person yeah. or she's a good person. But guess what? Everybody, Every the scaffers, almost 90% of them, have come out to say that this person is not a nice person. And America is such an organized, it's not just America, most of the, the countries in the diaspora, you know, the European they are very organized, especially about um, labor, about treating yeah, your staff. Yeah, I guess it's well. All. They're very organized, so they take these things very important. Um, that is what, what is killing Lizzo what, too. Yes, Beck, I was going to come yes, to that. Yes, it's what is killing see, Lizzo right now. What we see in front of the cameras, it can be, it can just be for the camera. I mean, Oprah Winfrey was also very generous on our show. And then she a did lot a lot. Our yeah. actors have yeah. stuff to say about yeah. her. Um, Lizzo, it affected her. Yeah. She meant, I mean, that that was the reason why. But you can say that about crushed. my girl Wendy Williams. Well, we've not no, heard. No, she shows she, she shows you who she is. We've not heard that. <laughs> and guess what? No, no, none of the staff of Wendy Williams has come out yeah. to say. Even if people even already say that uh, Wendy is a witch, normally I love it. <laughs> we don't pretend in this quarter. So it's best it's best to show us who you are in front of the cameras <laughs> and what? behind the cameras. Somebody like Wendy, she doesn't even hurt anybody. She just wants to do her thing and go. Yeah. But all these people who are always. Doing nice, nice, yes, nice. At the yes. end of the day, people still have See, to, to be honest. To know a man is know him inside his house, right? Because you know a lot of people come out and they are, you know, super yes, nice. They yes, do the best yes. things. They are generous, but inside they are different human beings. That's right. And this is also a point of call to even Nigerians, the celebrities. We've seen certain situations. I mean, as at yesterday, there were talks about the way um, DJ Chicken is a particular boy that works for him, and he's always um, very physically assaulting him, slapping him, sure hitting that, him. I'm sorry, but I want to say something about DJ Chicken. Yeah. Are you sure that it does not have like some condition? It, pro it probably because, does. You know, he's always does. very restless. Maybe because people might think it's all about oh the show, mm -hmm. it's just, but he's always just very restless. Yeah. He can't even sit down. He can't even. It's it's. See, 
There are lots of things that we celebrate in this country, and when we take a closer look at it, it's, it's not supposed it's, to be. Oh, yeah. You know, um, not just DJ Chicken. I mean, there was a video that circulated where the video was slapping no, no, his no, bodyguard. No, no, I did not see the slap. You did not see the slap. Not that was not a slap. I did not see the slap. Okay, I saw the slap. I did not. I saw the slap. I did not. It's not even. You're not. Don't don't touch anybody. Don't touch yeah, anybody yeah, physically. Yeah. But I don't. saw that he was trying to defend the boy. I don't know what you, transpired. I don't know what happened. But I did not see that slap. The clip I saw, I yeah. did not see any slap. So but it was that particular blog that is always giving one very <laughs> sensational, you know, title that, you know, captured it in a very funny way. Yeah.